moment. I'm sitting with a young lady. She's just completed her polygraph examination, a pre-employment polygraph screening process. It's taken just over an hour and a half and um, the test has now been concluded. The same lady also underwent a what they call a computerized voice stress analysis. Um, some people call it a voice polygraph. She's done one last week and um, sad to say they flagged this lady, uh, this lady um, and uh, did not recommend her for employment. The company, um, on the other hand, decided that they wanted to give her the absolute benefit of the doubt and send her for a polygraph. I must also say it's the same company that made use of polygraph tests, uh, pre-employment screenings in the past. But um, after COVID or during COVID, everyone decided that they need to uh, cut costs and uh, hence they were convinced or persuaded to um, swap the good old polygraph uh, tests for computerized voice stress analysis. Now this lady is sitting in front of me. We've just completed this test. As I said, it's taken just over an hour and a half to do the test. Um, miss, I want, um, uh, Miss Z, I'll call you. Um, you've just completed this test. Tell us about the previous test. Um, you, where did you do that? I did it over the phone. Over the phone. So somebody phoned you and then they did it over the phone. Yes. And um, what sort of questions did they ask you? They asked about theft, um, confidentiality. What would I do if I saw a colleague drinking during work hours? What would I do if I see a colleague stealing? Questions mm -hmm. of that kind. And obviously questions about myself, have I ever been arrested? Mm -hmm. ever been arrested? Okay, and uh, how long did that test take? It took 10 minutes, 47 seconds. 10 minutes and 47 seconds. Now, just as a matter of interest, this company that um, did this test in 10 minutes and 47 seconds charged 600 Rand per section. So, um, yeah, I've also been approached uh, and uh, asked whether I would be prepared to do computerized voice stress analysis um, and I've declined that. I don't want to uh, play with people's lives, I don't want to waste the client's money and I also do not want to uh, put any individual's future in jeopardy. A computerized voice stress analysis has been proven to be not even be 50% accurate. In other words, folks, you want to save money rather than not do voice stress. Rather flip a coin, you'll be better off.